So in these crazy crypto times of big swings, staking some of your coins for the long term would be a wise move. Now, for those of you holding some of that good old Dogecoin, I'm going to be going over the three best staking exchanges that will either earn some passive income on your Doge. So if you're currently holding some Doge on, let's say, Robinhood, Weeble, or even an exchange like Coinbase, it's time to move your coins off there and put it into one of these passive income generating exchanges. Now, I first wanted to go over the price of Dogecoin on CoinMarketCap, and I'll tell you what, guys, this coin has dumped hard like most other alts. However, I think Doge has staying power, and it's been able to hold its own for the most part, being able to stay in the top 10 to 15 of all coins for a while now. So I do think it's going to rebound to much higher levels going into the next one to two years. So staking it right at this moment would be a very wise move, in my opinion. Now, <clears throat> Each one of these exchanges I'm going to be going over, I've personally used. So if you have any questions about them, feel free to message me below in the comments. But I did want to kick things off here with BlockFi because the interest rate for staking Doge here is really good. Now, BlockFi has a few different coins that you can stake. You can also take out crypto back loans, which is something I'm going to go over. But currently, you've got a 2% unlimited. So basically, you're going to get paid every single month at the end of the month. That's how it works. Um, and you could ha actually have the money reinvest into your Doge position, or you could have it turn into cash. It's really cool. I love the layout for BlockFi. I've had a great time using it uh, thus far. I don't hold any Doge here, though. I have some of uh, the BAT token. Um, also, I forgot to mention, if you guys want to check out any of these exchanges, we will have some bonus and resource links in the description. Now, they also do crypto back loans, and the loan rate on here is really low. It's like 4.5%. Um, you know, for example, uh, it's basically like a margin thing, so you got to be responsible with it. But you know, the interest rate is really low. You have to have a minimum of ten thousand dollars into like the coins that are available here. However, if you take out money and you're smart about it, you can actually leverage yourself up on BlockFi. So, really cool stuff there. Okay, let's keep the list going. Okay, now we've got Crypto.com. Now, Crypto.com offers a lot of different coins available for staking, and they do have Doge on here. Now, they have a calculator feature, which is pretty cool. Um, it'll show you, you know, if you put an X amount into Doge, what you're going to get paid back. Now, as far as Crypto.com goes, got to say, you know, I love the app. I don't have a ton of money in it, but, you know, I've used it. I've staked engine coin here and a couple others like ethereum but you can mess around with the calculator check it out and see what you can earn they don't have a loan feature on here which is something that would be awesome if they did that uh so i do got to say uh you know just for you know the overall uh block is still number one okay um last up i wanted to talk about uphold now uphold have recently introduced staking they've got some different coins available I've actually logged into my account this morning, <clears throat> just checking out my XRP position. You guys could see what it looks like here. Uh, you know, XRP is one of my biggest crypto holdings. I've got over 200K coins spread across some digital wallets and exchanges. Uh, you know, but I've come to really like Uphold. You know, I've been using it for a couple of years. They introduced staking recently. So if this is something you wanted to uh, check out, they do like, allow to, you to buy XRP, which is kind of hard to buy in the US right now. Uh, they've got over 100 plus cryptos here. Now, the last thing I wanted to talk about other than Dogecoin um, is some other coins I would recommend staking where you could earn some passive income. And I really want you guys to think about, you know, staking some of your long term holds. You know, for example, like I said, if you're just holding some coins like, you know, Ethereum, Dogecoin, Bitcoin, uh, you know, on apps or exchanges where you're not getting those, you know, the free passive income just for holding it, you're just missing out, right? Uh, even if it's little amounts, it's still free money. Okay, um, the BAT token. This is another coin that you're going to be able to uh, stake on a few different exchanges. BlockFi has it. I really like this coin for the long term. Uh, you know, it's an advertising coin. It's dumped hard like the rest of, you know, the coins in the market, but it's going to rebound at some point. And, you know, I like the when you're staking, it is a long term thing. You got to think long term with it. So you want to be involved with coins, projects that have that long-term potential. Uh, Uniswap is another coin I would recommend staking. It's a decentralized exchange. Uh, it, it's a very cool decentralized exchanges I think are going to grow massively in the coming years. And, you know, Uniswap is positioned to continue appreciating and doing well. Okay. And then we've got Polkadot. Okay. Polkadot is a software. It's basically an alternative to Ethereum. 
Uh, you know, I, I like it a lot. I think it's it's a coin you should add into your portfolio. The returns on it could be really good in the next couple of years. So I think it's going to be a consistent winner in the long term. And yeah, but uh, just to bring this all home, guys, if you do own some Doge right now and you're not staking it, I really encourage you to consider doing it as well as really any other coins that are available for staking. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching. We'll see you all in the next crypto video.